Well, this is a long, 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 long time coming. I mean, we're talking over a decade. Uh, us PC gamers waited for a sequel to StarCraft, which is pretty much regarded as the best RTS game ever created. Um, <clears throat> and so now today is the launch of StarCraft 2. It is July 27th, I, want, I believe. Um, I actually got the digital copy, meaning I did not have to leave and, and go to a store to get a physical copy. I actually downloaded it over Battle.net, and I purchased a, a license to play the game this morning. Now, a couple things I want to cover. First of all, I'm doing this once again, as everyone knows who follow along with my, my playthroughs. This is on a tripod and a cam. This is not direct feed. So what you're seeing is 1080p video. Yes, I am recording this in 1080p video to see if you can actually read the text and things like that. So give me feedback on what you can read. That's in 1080p now. If this ends up being too illegible, what I'll do is I'll, I'll, I'll downgrade the graphics to 720p on my PC. And that way, hopefully, everything will be blown up a little bit and it'll be a little bit more legible. But uh, here we go. I'm excited, man. I played StarCraft 1. I loved it. Um, and I cannot wait to jump into StarCraft 2. The first thing I'm going to do, obviously, is campaign. I want to get a little bit into the campaign. Now, just so everyone knows, because you might not know this, um, StarCraft 2 is not actually a complete game right now. What you've purchased, if you purchase this game, it's called Wings of Liberty. It's basically part one. What they've announced is that this game is going to be released as a trilogy. Um, and each release will actually be just as complete as a complete game. So this is going to have a campaign that's 29 missions long, and it's going to have all three races included, and also has full multiplayer with all three races included. However, what they're saying is they're going to have two more releases over the next couple of years that'll have even longer campaigns. So basically this is like a, a trilogy, and this is part one of three, which is pretty damn cool. Um, so here we go, and again, I apologize. This is on a tripod. First time I'm trying this with a PC game. Trying it in 1080p. If it doesn't work out, we'll downgrade the graphics. But let's start it out and see what it looks like. We will do normal difficulty. I'm sorry, but I think I'm pretty. Bu uh, I'm better than casual. I did play the first StarCraft, and we'll pump up the volume as needed here. Marsera, Fringe World Dominion Space, Caprulu Sector, recolonized 2502. Joey Rays. <laughs> what do we start at a saloon? I think we are. And in other news today, Emperor Arcturus Mengs killed a press conference commemorating the end of the so called Brood War some four years ago. The Brood Wars, remember that? It was the expansion. Was on the scene. Emperor, the threat of a new Zerg invasion is still very real, but instead of expanding our fleets, you've squandered... Uh oh, is this Jim Rayner? ...has been rebels like Jim Rayner. Oh, there he said Jim, said Jim Rayner. ...represents a clear and present threat to this dominion. Jim Rayner was the hero of the first StarCraft game. ...the most lawless revolutionary bent on spreading fear and dissension across the sector. Uh-oh. Uh Kerrigan. She was one of the operatives uh, that he was in love with, and then she got kidnapped by the Zerg due to the orders of that guy that was just on the TV. And she was converted by the Zerg, basically assimilated into their collective consciousness. It ain't over till it's over, you son of a bitch. Nice. Looks to me like Jim Rayner's still in full effect. Are my troops ready yet? Your forces are prepared and awaiting your orders, Commander. Uploading tactical data now. Good. About time we kick this revolution into overdrive. Cool. Jim Rayner returns. The hero from the first game is back, and he's a rebel this time. Backwater Station is the center of Dominion Logistics on Masara. Destroying Dominion Authority here will cripple Emperor Meng's operations throughout the planet. All right, basically, destroy the Dominion Outpost is the goal. Normal difficulty, your standard uh, infantry will be the Marine, which is the standard issue for the humans, or Terrans in this game. All right, let's check it out. Launch, probably going to load, I'm sure. Oh, Adjutant. Or not. What do you got for me? 
Dominion Forces have set up a logistics headquarters in the town of Backwater Station. This has become the hub for all operations on Marsara. The Dominion recently pulled troops out of the city and they are now under strength. Are the locals cooperating? The people of Backwater Station are known to be... What the hell's up with the audio? It's but jumping. Weapons and organization. If I can take that headquarters away from Mexico, It'll cripple him on this planet. On this poop poop planet. <laughs> the poop poop planet. Red planet. I'm gonna have to fuck around with the focus a little bit. I see those focus lines are back, which is annoying. I obviously don't want the focus lines, but at the same time, I want all the text to be legible, so it's going to be a difficult balance of deciding what I want to do here. Current mission, Liberation Day. Left click to select units, right click to tell select units to move or attack. Yes, we know this. It's basic RTS stuff. Uh, oh. Well, it's a good way to start off the campaign. Burp right. right into it. All right, here we go. All right, boys. Let's show the locals they don't need to fear the Dominion. Nice. And that's Rainer. Rainer's the hero, right? Sell me. You Commander. There are tutorial videos awaiting your review. Screw your tutorial videos. I already watched them, actually. Keep your intervals wide, your eyes open, huh. and your ass is covered. Let's move. I wonder what happened here. We got a dog running ahead of us. Looks like a plan. You can count on me. Dog's leading the way. Don't go up that road. Huh? Some, some, uh... Civilian just told us not to go up this road. That's interesting. Raiders roll. Oh shit. Here we go. Kick ass. Get him! They got fucked up. Rainer have any special abilities? Nope. No special abilities. Okay. Oh wait, what's this over here? What's this glowing thing? Is that anything? Or is that just a... That's absolutely nothing. <laughs> Count on me. Thought maybe it was a special item or something, but nope. Sounds like a plan. Oh, what do we have here? Look at this. Dominion hollow board. Keep a close watch on your neighbors. Descent will only slow our progress. Commander, destroying the Dominion Hollowboards will help incite rebellion against the Dominion. Nice. Basically, this guy Minx, he was, uh, he were, I think I believe he was part of the army in the first game, but then once he, uh, once he defended the Earth, he became a dictator. So now we have to kind of overthrow his dictatorship. Damn, this camera is not including all the menus, I'm noticing that. Ah, there we go. The camera was cutting off some menus, maybe it's better off to zoom out like that. So I can catch, you can see everything on the screen. It won't be perfect, but again, this is a direct feed, so, all right. Raiders roll. Raiders roll. Man up. Raiders roll. Where is everyone? Uh, oh, it's deserted. It's a trap, man. You can tell Sounds this is like a trap. A <laughs> oh, where'd he come from? I can't even fucking see him. Raiders roll. Do we have stim packs or anything? Nope, we got no stim packs. That sucks. Sell me. My neighbors. My family. This is starting to look ugly. To. This is like they killed everyone on the fucking planet. You can count on me. Uh oh. Commander, a large Dominion force is gathering. Oh in shit! The town. Then it's time to call in that special delivery we talked about. What would that be? Oh yes, let's get him. Nice. Thanks for the assist. We're with you, Raider. Very cool. We're Look at this asshole. Blow that shit up. Fuck your mother. Yeah. Big mouth. Oh, here's another one. Let's get this one. Raiders roll. 